I have the two public safety. He is on loose cannon, and at the time of his capture, he had to be approached with extreme prejudice. Extremely extreme prejudice. The extremist reveal his identity. Well, I'll be. It's not a I forget. A two-year veteran member of Knucklehead. Mike returns to the scene of the crime to do what he does best. And forming the backbone of Knucklehead. Kick it off, Mikey. Do what you do. Number three, the bombastic basis. This fearsome fugitive is extremely unstable and had to be approached with military backup. He has a hair trigger and is prone to episodes of explosive ferocity. Reveal this dangerous fugitive's identity. I'll be damned. It's Bill Steiner. A founding member of the original Knucklehead, Bill is back for more and packing his patented snarling ferocity and fearsome pumping baseline. Give it up, Bill! Give it up, Bill! Now, this is the one I've been waiting for. This is fugitive number two. The Branding Guitarist. He is infamous for wanton destruction of property, both public and private. Beware, he is known to melt threats, burst eardrums, and weaken foundations. Now reveal his identity. Jesus Christ! It's Omar Anderson! I can't believe it! Omar fucking Anderson! Give it up, players! The legendary Olaf's legendary six-string skills are that of legend! <laughs> Lastly, we have fugitive number one, the volatile vocalist. Considered to be very dangerous in front of large crowds. Aw, oh, hell, I recognize those curly locks anywhere. You know who's under that bag. What's her name? Bruce Ray is back, folks. Yeah! Enjoy, minions. Raise your glasses with me in a toast to the best lineup of Knucklehead ever. Or it'll be straight to hell with you, master!